you know, just remind our audience, you know, what what is floating? Yeah, so well, the, first, the first thing I always do when I'm talking about floating in that context is to explain literally what it is. Uh-huh. Um, because, as you say, th- my understanding of what floating is has evolved a lot over the last three years because that's how long I've been running Floatworks with my business partner, Chris. Yeah. Um, and, yeah, you, you can go in all different ways with it, but what it really is, it's a huge pod. It's got 10 inches of water in it, which has over half a ton of Epsom salt dissolved into it. So when you climb into that pod and you pull the lid down, Mm -hmm. you float effortlessly. And we, on our board, one of the guys on our board is a guy called Tim Strudwick, and he designed the pod that we use. It's called the Isopod. Mm -hmm. He's actually the original founder of Floatworks, and we kind of went into business with him and relaunched it. So his pod, the Isopod, is large. It's really big. So when you climb into this pod filled with water and Epsom mm-hmm. salt, it's really like you're getting into a car. Yeah. It's that big. And it's all white. It almost looks like something that it might be designed by Apple. Mm-hmm. And it's got a really beautiful UV backlit blue light. And you climb in, and you lie back, and you're completely supported. Mm-hmm. So you can totally relax. It's like you're lying on a bed, but you can't feel the bed because you're on water. So it's more like a cloud. The water's heated to exactly skin temperature, mm-hmm. so you can't feel it. Yeah. So after a while, your skin and the water become one, so you have no sense of touch and you have no gravity because you're floating. Mm-hmm. You can't hear anything, you can't see anything, you can't feel anything, and you have no sense of gravity. Yeah. So that's what floating literally is. Um, but the result of floating, I mean, we can talk about, there are all different results. Yeah. You can look at the science, you can look at how it makes you feel, why you do it, yep. um, et cetera. And you're, you're in there for one hour, I should probably mention as well. Yeah. So it's an hour alone with your thoughts in an environment that is not like anything else. 